Hi, happy Friday, welcome back. It's a very nice sunny morning today. I just got up and like slowly got ready. It's about 9 a.m. right now and I'm finally getting my nails done today. So I'm going to that appointment in like 40 minutes. I think it's been a month since I got them done because I had to cancel my appointment when I went to Newcastle for the weekend. I just hate them when they're like super long and grown out. It's so annoying and they get caught on everything. I don't like the look of them. So I'm just gonna get them cut back quite short again and probably just get a French tip in some color but I'll take my camera and hopefully vlog the appointment the lady that I go to Vanessa is so sweet and she never minds when I like set up my full tripod and film the whole thing it's really hard to get the angle right so that I can actually see what she's doing I need the camera to be like over the top of us but anyway I bring my big tripod and just hope for the best I feel like I kind of want to do like a chrome French tip today like a silver chrome but I don't know whether I'll have time for that because I think you have to book in for like extras if you want any sort of chrome or art and things like that so I'll just ask and see. I have my YouTube vlog from last week going up today and if you notice that some of the clips were like bad quality or there was lines across the screen that was just because I was like having a super tired day and I wasn't using the camera properly on the right settings. I was really annoyed when I saw it on the computer when I imported all the clips but today I'm just like playing around with the manual settings on this camera and making sure they are a lot better. <laughs> After I get my nails done, I need to go to the shops and get some food for some videos I have to create over the weekend. It's for some exciting collaborations on my Instagram and TikTok leading up to Christmas. I also had to postpone filming a lot of content for brands until I got my nails done because it's just really not a good look when you're like filming up close unboxings and things like that and your nails are so grown out. I kind of want to go to Indrapilly shopping center and look in the dish store but I don't know if I'll have time today because I'm also seeing friends later this evening for dinner. If you're in Brisbane you'll know it's annoying that they closed the Chermside dish store which wasn't really a big store anyway but it was nice to have that a little bit closer to where I live. And yeah that's basically what I have planned today. I have a call with my accountant at like one this afternoon. I just did my tax return with him which was kind of complicated because if you're an influencer or a content creator you have to be careful about what items you can claim back on your tax and what you have to declare in terms of gifts. It's really a learning curve coming into this industry and just making sure that you're doing everything properly. Anyway, I'll bring you with me to my nail appointment now and then I'll show you the final result. Okay, so I just got home from my appointment and also I ended up just going to Gasworks and getting some groceries because I couldn't be bothered to drive all the way to Indrapilly. It's just like a lot of traffic on the road and then I would have had to take the toll road and I just like couldn't deal with it. So anyway, I'll show you what I picked up. These bagels from the Bagel Boys, which is the onion ones, are so delicious. Like we buy these every weekend and basically have them all the time. So this new Tony's flavor of chocolate, I love this chocolate so much and this is like I think they're limited edition flavor at the moment. So it's dark and milk chocolate with brownie bits, which just sounds so yummy. It's like a collaboration with Ben and Jerry's. And then I randomly got this cereal because it was on special and I'm just craving cereal at the moment. I'm super hungry. So in a second, I'm gonna make a bagel with avocado and feta, and then I'll have some cereal on the side. I also got some coconut, but this is for a video that I'm gonna do for a brand soon. And these are the best chocolates ever. If you ever see these like Maltese or Kit Kat ones, they come out around like Christmas and Easter they're just so good. I also love my nails so much I asked her to cut them back quite short and I got some chrome French tips which I'm obsessed with. Anyway let's make some food. Mm -hmm. 
So I just tidied up the place a little bit. I cleaned the coffee table and the kitchen, as you saw. I've also been watching that Beckham documentary. I don't know if anyone's seen it on Netflix and it's actually so cute, him and Victoria. I just love her, she's so funny. And that documentary is really like showing her true personality. But yeah, unfortunately, Love is Blind is not up yet. So I'm just waiting for that to be added. And yeah, I'm going out to get Japanese for dinner with some friends tonight. So I'm basically just waiting for them to come over now. And we'll probably have some drinks here to start before we go 
go out. I'm a little bit scarred from last weekend because in my last vlog, I said I was going to film like a nice Sunday reset video on my Instagram. And I literally could not film it because I was so hungover on Sunday. And I only had four drinks on Saturday the night before. So I don't know if it's just like me getting older or whether it was because I had like sugary cocktails, but I was unwell. And usually when I'm hungover, cleaning up my entire apartment is actually what makes me feel better because I know I've had those hangovers where like you're actually deathly sick the whole day. And I'm not talking about those. Just when you feel really gross and unproductive, when you clean your entire space, I feel so much better. So yeah, that was annoying that I literally could not film that video because when I do like a Sunday reset video, it does take me quite a while. It probably takes me most of the day. I'd say like six hours because when you're filming the whole process, it starts to take a lot longer, like just setting up the tripod in so many different shots and making sure everything looks good on camera. Obviously, if I was just cleaning without the filming, it wouldn't take that long. But yeah, so I don't want to drink too much tonight or this weekend because I actually do want to film a cleaning video on Sunday. My apartment's at the stage where it just needs a bit of a deep clean. Like I haven't changed my sheets in a couple of weeks. I just changed the pillowcases last week because that was all I could really muster up the strength to do. And yeah, I might do a little bit of a vacuum now before my friends come over. I don't really have plans on Saturday night anyway at this stage so hopefully it's just a chill weekend and I'm just like watching shows and eating yummy food but please let me know what you're doing this weekend and if you live in Brisbane if you have any recommendations for me like cafes or places I should visit I've only been living here for almost two years so I just try and explore around the city as much as I can because that's obviously the area that I live in and I do work in South Brisbane like sort of quite far down towards the Gold Coast so I kind of get to explore those areas a little bit too I actually do love living here and I'm lucky that I already had some friends here when I moved up because otherwise it would have been very lonely. However, I am more of a quality over quantity friend type person. So I'm good with just a couple of people that I see semi regularly. And yeah, I obviously love when my family come and visit too. I'm not sure if I'm going to film dinner tonight because it's quite a dark restaurant. So it's just going to be quite difficult to bring my camera in there and actually show you what I'm eating. But if I film any videos or shots on my phone, I will show you. So I'll see how I go. So I just got home from dinner. We went to a yummy Japanese place called Hikari and basically just shared a whole heap of dishes like soft shell crab, chicken karage, tempura prawn, rolls, katsu curry. And yeah, everything was so good. I'm really full now. I'm just going to get ready for bed now. So I'll shower and take off all of my makeup and then get in my pajamas and start watching some reality TV, I think. But thank you so much for spending the day with me and I will see you in my next video.